Three days in the Smoky Mountains in three minutes? Let's go! First of all, Paula Deen's Pigeon Ford All You Can Eat. Go, it won't disappoint. Real cheddar biscuits and then two meats and four sides for the whole table until you're just tired of eating. They're just gonna keep bringing it and then free dessert. And then Dollywood, the park themed in trees, cause you know, wood. If it fits, it bakes. And of course they have a ton of rides, some little, some big, and some just right. And uh, I mean, we had a really good time. This day was a Wednesday, if that matters. We didn't wait in line more than like 25 minutes anywhere. Uh, there was a chance of rain that didn't happen, so that may have, you know, discouraged some crowds and stuff, but we had a blast, and we were there from the open of the park to the close of the park. I'll get to that in a second. Uh, highly recommend Dollywood. I had a really great time. It has something to offer for virtually every age, and at some point in time, you're gonna find yourself at the Chris Mill, and, uh, I you're gonna buy cinnamon bread. You're just gonna do it because I'm telling you to and you know you have eyes and ears and a stomach get the apple butter for this. It's worth the 99 cents that they charge extra. Trust me. As the day winds down and night approaches they have a dance party that you know I definitely didn't participate in but you know dance and then they have a huge fireworks show that then gets incorporated with some drones that have lights on them, I guess. I don't know, technology and stuff. And it's really cool, the whole thing set to music. Um, I didn't have that here because, you know, the crowd noise was terrible in this video, but it's really cool, you know, and uh, everybody loves it. Cause you know, freaking fireworks and drones. And Cade's Cove was only like 30 minutes from where we stayed, so we drove up there a little late in the day because we were, you know, sleeping in from the late night before, but it's cool. It's a national forest that's got like 20 miles that you can drive through and see animals and churches and old buildings and stuff that they had in there, and uh, maybe some deer if you're lucky. But anyway, I do recommend going like early in the morning or late in the evening if you want to see more animals because, you know, that's when animals are active. These bears actually were at a store in Pigeon Fords that you could pay three dollars and go see. So there's that. Now I'm no cartographer but I believe the south end of Pigeon Forge has a restaurant called The Local Goat and they have deep fried deviled eggs. And then if you go up to Gatlinburg you know it's Gatlinburg. They had a mirror maze and putt putt and that's all that really interested us. If you want to buy souvenirs, come back to Pigeon Forge. It's half price and half the crowd, so might as well. Anyway, guys, thanks for watching. I know this is kind of different, but, uh, you know, it's what it is. Uh, if you've been to the Smoky Mountains, let me know what you did down in the comments. And like, share, comment, subscribe, I don't know, other stuff. Uh, have a good one.